Hey guys, what's going on? It's the Nerdy Tiger here, and I'm here with day 24 <laughs> of the Nerdy Advent series. We're going to try and find a way into this massive present. <laughs> exactly what we're working with. <laughs> it is Christmas Eve, so day before Christmas. So this is our second to last opening in this series. If you're wondering why this particular one had uh, little tubes on the bottom of it, uh, Dark Cry formed it into a tree shape. And that was the only way to get it to stand on its own. <laughs> Almost in. Halfway in. <laughs> I wonder how big the actual item inside is. <laughs> and there's my scissors and the present. <laughs> second to grab my scissors. There we go. Right then, let's uh, cut through all this tape. Try and get in. as we can. Looks like I started on the wrong end. We have to do the same first. <laughs> Good thing I've got plenty of space in all directions from my desk. Sorry, this is taking a while, guys. <laughs> Let's just say that if there's ever a sellotape shortage in the world, we have a pretty good idea who to go to. <laughs> I think Dark Rays used half of the world's sellotape on this present. Right, we finally see the parcel. Whoa! What the heck is this? It feels like a dang sword! <laughs> Legit, my first thought is that this feels like some sort of sword. This legit feels like a sword! <laughs> and if it is, I'm gonna be so blown away. Especially because if I'm remembering the list that I gave to Dark Cry of my favourite animes, there was only two on that list that involved swords. Fairy Tale and Attack on Titan. Now this seems a little small to be three little thin to be three DMG from from Attack on Titan. So if this is a replica of one of Urza's swords, I cannot guarantee you're not gonna need a headphone warning. <laughs> I'll put that in place now just in case. <laughs> what is it? Well, it's not as a sword, it's a different kind of green sword, I don't think. Unless I'm forgetting one. Let's have a look. It's something. What in the world? Who's 
is this? I'm trying to figure out whose sword. I'm trying to figure out which character's sword this is. I'm just seeing if there's any labelling anywhere in, in amongst all this wrapping paper. Whose sword is this? Event? No way, hold on. Is that. I was going to say, is it Freed's Rapier? From Fairy Tale, but the handle's different. I'm trying to figure out whose sword. This has got me genuinely stumped. I'm not sure whose blade this is. It's very cool, don't get me wrong. It is an awesome looking replica. Let's get it out and see without all the crinkly plastic. is definitely an amazing foam replica. I just can't think whose sword it is off the top of my head. Oh, hold on. It could be one of the swords from Sword Art Online. It could be. I'm trying to think off the top of my head, but I can't name a specific character. Uh, if you guys can think of one, let me know. But it is an amazing replica, and I'll definitely be doing some research and figuring out whose sword it is. So that is it for day 24. Can't wait for day 25, and I'll see you tomorrow on Christmas Day. Bye, guys.